We begin tonight with an NBC 15 News reality check investigation. Pritchard Water Works and Sewer Board was recently smacked with a consent order from ADEM. It shows multiple violations of permits over the course of four years, but some water board members tell us they were caught off guard by the violations, saying they were never made aware that the consent order was even issued, nor were they made aware the board has to pay almost a quarter of a million dollars in fines. NBC 15's Karis Harmon reports tonight some board members are now seeking legal help. Yes, and the board members tell me one of the reasons why they lawyered up is because they do not want to be associated with those violations. The fine has a price tag of $234,675, and while this consent order reveals some of the issues going on within the water board, current board member John Johnson tells me he and board member Cherry Doyle did not know about the consent order until watching our story last week. A director Dole and myself have had to hire an attorney of our own that was never voted on, um, that was never shared with Director Doyle and myself. Johnson says there was a meeting back in September where board leadership, the legal team, and the system engineer went into executive session, but he and Director Cherry Doyle did not. Expecting for them to come out um, and do the legal thing and discuss what had gone on and if anything needed to be voted on just like you know approving that two that quarter of a million over a quarter of a million dollars that has you know been agreed to be paid on at um with adm that never happened it was so much stuff that they wouldn't tell us it was so many things that uh they did that behind our back and we didn't know anything about it but then they hollered the board Johnson says one of the main reasons they hired an attorney was because they do not want to be associated with any of that activity. He says they knew nothing about. It's so embarrassing to be um, a Pritchett Water Board member. You know, with the media, when they say, when you all and your peers say the Pritchett Water Board, that's not the case because it's five board members, but it's only three board members that are making the decisions. I reached out to Chairman Heidelberg along with Jay Ross, the Pritchard Water Board attorney, for comments, but I haven't heard back from either. Late this afternoon, we discovered there's a special called Water Board meeting tomorrow. We'll be sure to keep you updated. Kim.